Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Talking Softball with Dutch. I am your host, Phil Allen, a.k.a. Phil from Mount Airy. And guys, we have got one exciting game ahead of us tonight. The Rawhurst Cafe is coming off of two straight losses, and that's disappointing. But... Before that, they had two straight wins for the first time in team history. So, Dutch, what do you think about the Rawhurst Cafe and their chances tonight? (laughs) Hey, Phil. Well, to be honest, Phil, I like their chances. Um, You know, I mean, they they lost two in a row, um, but they put up... Good fights in both, and uh, most hated is a really tough team. For them to run with them, I think goes a long way towards showing that this team's a, a pretty good team. Yeah. That's a good point, Dutch, because the fact of the matter is, when you look at this team from top to bottom, they're better than they have been at any point over the last four years. And I think that maybe next year we might be looking at a 500 card team. And and this year, you could call me crazy, but I think there's a chance that this team could steal the playoff game. (laughs) Yeah, Phil, you're, you're right. I'll call you crazy. Yeah, I wouldn't go that far on the playoffs because there are gonna be uh, a low seed, which means they're going to play a pretty tough team in the first round. But, you know, we'll cross that bridge when we get to it. I'm more worried about tonight, and you got a lot of guys missing tonight. What do you think about that, Stone Cold? Because that that's a big deal to me. Well, Phil, I mean, the fact is, you look at the Runners Cafe, and they play pretty well as of late playing 500 ball over the last four. And tonight, they're going to be without Brahim Carter. They're going to be without Doug Charles. And they're going to be missing Jeff Wincoop. Now, the fact of the matter is that that's at least one or two, maybe even three very important players to this team. And that's the bottom line. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I mean, all these guys, I mean, this team can't really afford to lose anybody you know, they're, they're going to be playing shorthanded tonight, and I think that's going to make for a tough win for this team. Guys, you know what? I understand what you're saying. They are missing some important pieces, but for me, this is a makeup game. It's on short notice. Neither team's coming in particularly prepared, and I think the Rawhurst can steal one. Well, Phil, <laughs> we'll see, man. We're running out of time, and uh, thanks for joining us on Talking Softball with Dutch. For myself, for Phil, for Bad Airy, yeah, for Stone Cold Steve Austin. You know what? What the hell? I'm going to say that the Warren Hurst is going to whoop some ass tonight, and that's the bottom line, because Stone Cold said so.